Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you how to reverse number that we have given like if you give 1 2 then the output will be should be 2 1 right for this in the right program so I will declare first value that is then is a given number and I reverse now I take input from user that's why I will take one scanner class scanner system dot in this is the standard input from scanner so here it will show here error to this we need to add one package that is import java dot utl dot start right so now error wins removed so system dot out dot print ln enter a number to reverse reverse which number you want reverse that we have to enter for that I will take that number in here and it equal to just dot next int now that number is in our end so that I will use why n is greater than 0 n is greater than 0 I need to find out the remainder for that I will declare remainder here the remainder right so to do this to do this we have to find out the first remainder of your number for this I will use n percent of 10 it will give the remainder means I will give in comment that is add returns returns remainder remainder and reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus remainder now n value should be decremented after doing some first operation n value is, is equal to n divided by 10 right this is the logic to print our reverse of number here initially reverse is equal to 0 and where is to store is store Palette in reverse and we need to print system dot out dot print ln system reverse reverse of plus n is 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 equal to plus reverse now right click on it and run your file you should have to give your rewards that is if you give one two three four five 
you need to print output as five four three two one let's see in dot and reverse of oh sorry because you can already become zero that's why it is saying that zero is this but our actual input is one two three four five right so that it's giving five four three two and one this logic to reverse the yes, suppose our input is input is two four four three let's give five six now our output will be six five four three let's see Three four five six and in that six five four three exactly this is the how you you are finding